Good morning, students. Welcome to your I Learn English Conversation class. Before moving to the chapters given in our conversation book, first let us know that what is a conversation. Conversation is actually a communication or exchange of ideas or thoughts among ourselves. The way we present ourselves in front of others, the way we speak. the way we treat other people that is called conversation okay but why do we have this conversation session we already read the stories in our english literature books or some different subjects the main aim of conversation session is to um, you know is to indulge you all in the habit of reading you should always have the habit of reading children it is very important so you should always try to speak understand read and converse in english if you try with small small words and you start to join small words together you will be easily uh, able to speak in english always try to have a small paragraph of one chapter an extract of one chapter and try to have a reading habit try to read one paragraph daily okay so this way your english will improve all right you will also get to know new words you will learn new spellings also so that will help you in improving your english so this is the main aim of conversation for you to read understand speak and converse in english with others now let's move to our book now let's start with the third chapter it is given on page number 3 thomas has a heart it is called hand hands, hands. Thomas says my horse is very clever he can count 1 2 3 4 5 next page Thomas takes hands to a village Thomas thinks i got i get money here he makes a sign it says my horse can count a few people stop Thomas says would the people give me a number okay now this story is about a clever horse a horse of a, uh, a horse uh, who, who is named as hans so there is a horse and it is called hans so thomas is the owner of the horse and he says that the horse is very clever he says that the horse can count so he has made a sign of that horse that and uh, what is written on that sign that my horse can count okay so wherever he goes he takes his horse along with him and he says to everyone that my horse can count all, all right now adrika mute yourself sorry unmute yourself Good morning teachers A woman shouts nine Thomas says to Hans count to nine Hans hits the ground with his foot foot the people foot the people say 1 2 3 4 the people look at his food they say 5 6 7 8 9 the people look at thomas very good what happened now so when he went to the market he met many people there so a woman shouted nine so as soon as the woman shouted nine thomas says to hen hands 
to count nine. So immediately Hans hit his foot on the ground nine times. So and the people started to count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And everyone was amazed to find out that a horse can count because he tapped his foot nine times. Okay, after hearing nine. Akshansh. Yes, ma'am. Continue. Hand stop. The people say who. Oh. They say your who. They say your horse can count. They give Thomas money. Thomas and Hans go to Lord of Villages. People shout out numbers. Fifteen, eight, ten. Hans hits the ground with his foot. The foot. people give Thomas money. Yes. Now what happened? That the woman got amazed to see that the horse can count. So, after hands stopped, people were shocked. They said, oh, this horse can count. And everybody started to give money to hands. Then, after, uh, after that, Thomas and hands went to several villages. And everybody used to shout numbers and hands used to hit his foot on the ground to that very numbers. And they both, Hans and his owner, that is Thomas, they, they got a lot of money from people by counting numbers. Okay. Now, Charvi. Yes, ma'am. Huh? One day, a boy watches Hans. He also watches the people. The boy says to Thomas, the people can count, but your horse cannot count. Thomas says, I don't understand. The boy says, hands watches the people. They look at his foot. He hits the ground then they look at you. He stops. Thomas is sad. He thinks hands cannot count. The people do not give money to him anymore. Yes, very good. Mute yourself, shall we? Yes. Now what happens? One day, a boy was watching Hans. He noticed that whenever, uh, whenever the people used to uh, say the uh, say the counting, um, Hans started to hit his foot on the ground. And as soon as people started to look at Thomas, he immediately stopped. So the boy said to Thomas that your ha that your horse cannot count. It's just he notices the eyes of people. When people look at his foot, he starts tapping the ground. And when they start looking at you, he stops the counting. He stops the tapping. That means he do not know the counting. Now to hear that Thomas was very sad because Thomas thought that his horse could count. Now everybody got to know the secret that he could not count so nobody gave him any money. So Thomas was very sad in the end. Okay? Now Aradhya Yes ma'am Give me the spelling of village Village. Varun, unmute yourself. Village. 
very good aradhya can you hear me yes ma'am tell me the plural of foot what is the plural of foot feet very good pradnya yes ma'am what is the spelling of understand u n d e r s t a n d very good thank you ma'am can you tell me the opposite of sad yes ma'am hmm what is it happy good happy very good mute yourself vedansh yes ma'am opposite of day will be what day night night good mute yourself Ananya Good morning teachers good morning what is the spelling of ground G O U N D ground, ground. G O U N D No G please tell on your own okay whatever you know G say hmm. G R O U and d u and d good but try to speak on your own okay whatever you know if you will if you will say wrong i'll correct you no problem good mute yourself jasir unmute yourself hello Jasir Yes ma'am Yes is uh, okay now let's start with chapter 4 the man the boy and the donkey everyone on page number 76 and Jasir please start reading Okay ma'am A father goes to the a market with his son He says to his son I want a donkey the boy says look I uh, look I like her. The man says, "Yes, yes, she is very good." He buys the donkey. He gets on the donkey. The man and the boy leave the market. One on the way home, they see a young man and a. They uh, the young man says, "Look at uh, the lazy man." The young woman says, "Yes, he rides on, and his son walk." Okay, good. Mute yourself. Thank you, ma'am. Okay, so this story, children, is about a man, a boy, and a donkey. So what happens one day? Father goes to a market with his son. There he says, he he says to his son that I want a donkey. I want to purchase a donkey. and the boy says okay look at that one i like her i like that donkey the man says yes she is very good let us buy that donkey he buys the donkey and he gets on the donkey okay so the father sat on the donkey and they both left the market on the way home while returning home <clears throat> they saw a young man and a young woman the young woman says look at the lazy man his son is walking and he is riding the donkey now trishar please continue reading and page number 
the boy get of the donkey the man says now every one happy everyone's happy the boy says yes they see a few people the people log laugh and laugh at laugh at the man and the boy they say ha 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 one man says look at the silly people one woman says yes they have a donkey but they walk yes good mute yourself now what happened the man gets off the donkey and his son gets on the donkey now the man came down and his son sat on the donkey so they were walking then again they met an old man and an old woman they saw the uh, small boy riding the donkey and they said look at this lazy boy his father is walking but he is sitting on the donkey then again both the father and the son they got confused now they now the son also came down he also got off the donkey now he said now everyone's happy we both are walking and the, along with our donkey then again after walking for a while they met a few people and they all started to laugh at them they all were laughing they all said ha 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 look at those silly people they have the donkey with them but still they both are walking now let's see what happens adya yes ma'am continue beta the man and the boy get on the donkey the man says now everyone happy the boy says yes they see a mother which her daughter the girl says look at the poor donkey the woman says yes she can't carry the man and the boy very good please mute yourself now what happens now when both of them were walking along with the donkey everybody started to laugh and make fun of them now what did they do they both sat on the donkey and they started to ride the donkey soon they they were walking they met a mother and a daughter so both of them said oh my god look at that donkey poor donkey he is carrying both the father and the son how cruel are they they both are riding the donkey together so and uh, the donkey cannot carry them then again both the father and the son got confused they got off the donkey now let's read what happens next yes akshat continue reading page number 86 the man and the the man and the the boy get off the don, donkey the man says i have a i have an idea the boy says i have an idea too the man says let's carrying her let's the carry the boy says yes. carry her the boy says yes 
did pick, pick up, up their dog. Pick up their donkey. The man says, "Now everyone's happy." They see a few uh, uh, more people. The people laugh. They say, "Say, ha ha ha!" The man says, "Look at the silly people." The woman says, "Yes, they have a donkey." But they don't ride her. The girl says, "No, they carry her." Very good. Now, what happens? Uh, mute yourself, Akshat. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Now, what happens when they both were riding the donkey? The mother and the daughter started to laugh and scold them. now what happened they both got off the donkey and the father and the son said that yes we have an idea and what was the idea to hold and carry the donkey so what did they do they both carried the donkey in their hands and as soon as they were walking they met a few people again and all the people started to laugh at them again they said ha 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 look at those silly people they have a donkey with them and they are holding it like a baby the donkey is meant to be carrying them or their loads but they are carrying a donkey as their baby so everybody started to make fun of them again okay now what have you understood from this chapter that you cannot make everyone happy no matter whatever you do somebody or the other will not be happy or satisfied with it so whatever you feel is right for you whatever you think is correct and you are not um, upsetting anyone with that that is fine you cannot make everyone happy at the same time okay now ansh please unmute yourself ansh sinha unmute yourself can't hear you please remove your headphone good morning ma'am good morning ansh can you tell me the spelling of laugh ma'am spelling of laugh is l a u g h ma'am okay thank you yes yes pay attention in the class only no okay and what is the opposite of opposite gender of woman man man very good mute yourself ansh good shoaib good morning ma'am good morning okay shoaib tell me the spelling of donkey ma'am d o n k e y very good mute yourself can we Yes, spelling of daughter daughter d a u g h t e r mute yourself pratik mute yourself yes, kanvi yes opposite or uh, opposite gender of mother ma'am father father very good and what is the spelling of father f a t h e r good mute yourself athar Atharv, can you hear me? Atharv, Sonakshi. Good afternoon, ma'am. Good afternoon, beta. 
ओके सो प्लीज टेल मी द स्पेलिंग ऑफ वॉक वॉक मैम वॉक स्पेल द वर्ड वॉक W A L K W A L K yes good and opposite of good what will be the opposite of good good bad ha huh, good bad okay good <coughs> excuse me mute yourself okay so with this we have completed <coughs> excuse me so with this we have completed our conversation chapter 4 okay